On the protest sixth day, demonstrators in Oakland held a march and rally today, once again calling for an immediate ceasefire in the fighting, as well as calling on the university to divest in companies with ties to Israel. Our Ricky Sayer is at the rally right now. He brings us the very latest. Ricky, what can you tell us? <laughs> Yeah, there is a lot going on right now. Pro-Palestinian protesters right now have linked arms right here on the lawn of a University of Pittsburgh building. We want to show you what's going on as they have linked arm here. They have set up two tents, and just off to the side is University of Pittsburgh police. Just a few moments ago, some of the organizers of the protest told some of the protesters that if they don't want to be arrested, that they would have to move to the sidewalk. We want to make clear that we haven't heard from the University of Pittsburgh for police and any arrests would be taking place. But that's the situation right now as we see these protesters linked arms. What they're fighting for is they want the University of Pittsburgh to divest from Israel. They want the University of Pittsburgh to also disclose any investments that they have in Pittsburgh. And we want to show you some video we took about an hour ago. This is when protesters move closer to the Cathedral of Learning. This is right across the street from where we are at. They again tried to set up a tent. And as you can see, University of Pittsburgh police physically pushed protesters back toward the street. Some of those protesters were shoved, and we want to make the distinction that the the lawn is part of the private property of the University of Pittsburgh uh, versus where the street and the sidewalk is. That is public property. And earlier we saw the protesters peacefully walk around the, you know, the cathedral here, and they stayed on the street at that moment. And Right on the right on the lawn, we actually saw there were some graduation activities taking place. We also want to tell you some of what we heard the protesters saying before when they were rallying. They said that we're here to tell the university they need to uh, listen to the demands of them and stop prioritizing lining their pockets. That was a quote they said that, quote, this must end. And some of those protesters said that they would stay there until the divestment takes place. Again, there's a lot going on right now. Protesters have formed a circle around this part of the lawn, and the police are staying right to the side, and we're going to set, set, send things back to you.